Yes, sir. It's your boy B Hayes back with another one, guys. So this is happening, guys. Let's go ahead and take a look at it because now is the time to be making the money, guys. I told you guys to rinse and repeat by a few weeks ago last month. Once the stock market took off and strength, you want to sell into strength because we knew it wasn't going to sustain and hold itself as we see this full force bullishness coming within this bearish market. So you definitely want to sell within strength, guys. Don't try to wait. Oh, it could go higher. It's going to go, you know, you know, always trying to get the tip, tip, top. Always trying to get the most out of something when you're not understanding the logic behind the system and being successful in the market. And that's taking a piece of the pie, not trying to get the whole entire move, guys. Getting in at a, you know, strategic time, buying their support, selling near resistance, and also sometimes getting in a little bit before support and also selling a little bit before resistance in order to make sure you just get in that, 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 that small gain in the, in the middle. That way, your chances of success in a successful trade or investment is always you know seven out of ten so always move with that system guys and if it go against you always use that support where you bought it as a level indication on where you should get out of that stock at if you bought their support at eight dollars and the stock trading at eight dollars and it dropped down to seven dollars and uh fifty cents seven dollars and sixty cents seven seventy five what if it was at eight we're not 750 my bad you want to get out near 780 you know give it a little room to wiggle up under that support because we know market makers tends to drop the stock price down or asset and they'll knock out a lot of stop losses and then rip the stock right back up so you have to cut losses intelligently that's where that comes into play at knowing how the psychological points and market makers maneuver around the market getting you the best exit possible and the best inch entrance possible so anyways guys let's go ahead and take a further look at what's going on what stocks to watch on today stock future rises wall street looks to snap a three week losing streak u.s stock futures rose friday following a choppy trading session as traders consider federal reserve chair jerome powell latest comments on inflation so the dow jones future rose 221 points the s p 500 climbed 0 0.8 percent so we know uh, some of the stocks that's having the biggest moves in the pre-market right now, guys, is Tesla. Um, we got DocSign. We also got a lot of the stocks that we've been calling out, guys, that you're more in tune with that we've been talking about on the channel, which one of our babies is going crazy in the pre-market this morning, which is Upstart. I alerted that in VIP, told you guys to get up on that. This bad boy is ready to run. It already broke through resistance at 26. Our next resistance is now very very close at twenty eight dollars and eleven cents that we possibly what, what we hit in the pre-market we hit twenty seven seventy almost hitting twenty eight as soon as the bell open the market open we go up to test twenty eight eleven probably come down pull back a little bit and then fly and rip through it guys that bad boy is going to go another banger is doing good in the pre-market is tilray brands guys also snapchat we called that on yesterday in vip few people of course made over 100 percent they did call options it's sitting at 1257 it went up tested resistance at 12 dollars and 60 cents on this morning it broke through it in the pre-market with ease now it's cooling back pulling back a bit scare some people out before ripping and staying above 1260 guys and going towards 13 so you definitely want to have that on your radar as well we also got amc guys doing very well in the pre-market up over 3.7% at its peak was up over about 4.3% guys in the pre-market. It hit $9.01 and now we hovering right around that $9 area guys. So that's a good sign. I told you guys as the market overall market pushback, AMC definitely will be pushing back with it guys. So you already know what to do. Add your boy on Instagram at the Behave Show. Get in VIP. Also hit me up if you want a 15 minute or 30 minute phone call. I love y'all. We out and God bless you. Go.